Oh, yeah, they finally removed the little barrier thing. I still have to wonder what was going on over there. Oh, what's up? Hello. Hey. Glad you came. What's going on over here? Just business. Huh. So, you wanted me to repay you for seeing the fish up there? Like... I mean, not just that. You do still need to repay me for the room that you temporarily, you know, rented out. Because you're poor. Well, I mean, yeah, I am. So, so I have... yeah, what's your idea here? So, I, I don't think you know what my, uh, my general plan is. And I don't, I don't know if that's something I should really tell you, but... Uh... Leave out as much as possible. I'm gonna need you to do a little snooping around for me. All right. How good are you? How good are you at spying and getting information on people? Well, I'm decent at talking people up, but if you're asking for the stealth type of spying, then you're out of luck. Really, anything would work. I just I need to get a little bit of information on. Well, pretty much everyone. Alright. I guess really, it'll work since I'm a newcomer, right? Yeah, any information you can get would be fantastic. Uh, if there is... Here, actually, I think I have something that might help you with this. Follow me. No. Uh, what was that? It's not important. Okay, then. Huh. Yeah, this stuff has been spreading lately. It is what it is. Just leave it. Don't touch it. Hmm. The place I'm taking you to is kind of far. Uh, don't- just don't tell anyone about this, I believe. Do you mind at least giving me a summary of where we're going? You'll see it when we get there. Should I be concerned? No. No, you're fine. I wouldn't hurt you if you're doing it for me. That's... respectable. Well, if I need you to do a job, there's no point in me getting rid of you yet. Well, I mean, yeah, I guess. I have something over here that I think would probably help. Alright. You said you weren't doing too well in the stealth department. Yeah, stealthiness was never my strong suit. Me neither. I always just rush into things, which, to be fair, when you're me, that works a lot better. Yeah, I suppose it does. Speaking of uh, weird events that's or whatever that's been going on around here, did did you hear about the president? I didn't even know there was a president. I don't pay enough attention. Oh uh, well, he he's dead. Whatever. I place this later. Who cares? Actually, do you have a pick on you? Yes, I do. Mind those two blocks, please. Ooh, secret passage. Should have been more prepared for this. Ooh. All right. Uh, you might need some of these. All right. Uh, do I have to pay you back for these? Don't bother. I suppose not, since you're, well, giving them to me to complete a job for you. Exactly. I wouldn't give them to you. If, you know, whatever. You're you're completing a job. There's no reason I should make you pay extra. Yep. Yeah. So, specifically speaking, why am I having to do this job? Like, this isn't really a normal sort of business proposition, is it? I mean, 
you know, working the counter at the hotel. That's normal. Working at a farm or maybe mining some stuff up for you. That's normal. But spying on people is a little, well, abnormal for my sort of job interests. So I'm, I'm guessing you're not going to tell me, but if you... Well, what? question because this will probably determine how much I tell you how much do you know about the founders um I know well that's a bit of a tricky question all I know is that there are some people you don't want to tell you know too much I don't so really know much about you so I can't really tell if I can tell you everything I know. That's... But I guess by saying that, I'm insinuating how much I know. Yeah, I, I got a feeling about you. Just a hunch, but... But, then again, I'll, I'm not really interested that. in it. It's history, so... How much do you know about reincarnation? I don't know much about that, no. When a founder died, what happened was they, re they were reincarnated as another person. Mm, I know that much, yeah, but the I'm process trying... of it is finicky. I'm, I'm trying to figure out who still has some sort of ties to there. Okay, so this is a sort of eliminating other powers sort of thing. Think of it like a little bit... Uh, think of it like research, right? I, I'm not doing anything wrong, I just I just need to learn a little more before I... Uh... Well, that research wouldn't be important unless you were planning to do something with it. I mean, you don't know that. Maybe I just, you know, maybe I just want to know things. I suppose, but there wouldn't be much of a reason to it. Is there anywhere specifically you want to start? No, I don't really mind where I start. I just want to pay this off. I don't have much, uh... I don't have much standing around here. So, I mean, I might as well get known for finishing a deal. I'm wondering if it would be better to do it with people who are home or people who weren't. Because direct conversation... I don't know how much we'd be able to get out of people. Well, it depends. I mean, if the idea is if I were to present, I'm, again, talking to people, I'm good at that. But if I were to present a reason for them to tell me things, a threat, a sort of issue that they that I need to know about, then maybe there would be some reason for them to actually admit to whatever they know. But I can't just make up a threat. It has to be real. If I made up something and and that came out as not being real, then they'd pretty much know that either I'm the threat or I was working for someone. Just do whatever you have to do to get information. Alright. What about those two? They seem to be watching us rather intently. Well, I'll tell you one thing. I know a bit about that one on the left. Mm, what do you know? If you could spare that information. Don't know if I can. Well, is it good information or is it bad? Depends on your morals. I'll take it as bad, then. Not necessarily. Well, I mean, when someone says, depending on your morals, that does sort of suggest a bit of moral abnormal abnormality, so, I mean, I mean... Not necessarily. I mean, my, I think my morals are pretty in check, I mean... Except, I mean, I am accepting this job to potentially put lives at risk, but that's just, you know... Let me see. I wouldn't say at risk. 
This is for the betterment of the future of everyone here. A lot of people have said that, and a lot of people have done bad things when they say that. But I'm being genuine in this. Things will be a lot better if I can get this information. What are they doing up there? <laughs> I don't know. They, they look like they're having fun. <sighs> no one gets any work done around here. Well, I mean, I made a melon farm, so, you know, no starvation. It's a pretty nice piece, piece of work. I miss the days when things actually got done. Oh yeah, I heard there were some uh, pretty impressive researchers and builders from back then. Yeah, well... Too well, bad they're they all are. dead. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'd say for the better, to be honest with you. Well, I mean, most of them did pretty good stuff. They made some cool stuff, they built the infrastructure for this place. If it weren't for them, none of us would be here. Listen, just shut up with all that, okay? Because anything you read in your history books, I guarantee you it's wrong. Mmm, sure. History is written in the bias that, well, whoever wins is seen as the good guy, and that's not always true. Right, the most powerful party determines the morals of the area, right? But who said anything about history books, huh? I mean, I might have gone digging around some old ruins or whatever, but history is not often written in books around here. I mean, yeah, there are books, but not many survived. I have a bit of evidence that shows that a lot of books were either destroyed, hidden away, or just straight up lost. Yeah, it's not just books either. There's something else I've been looking for. Well, what would that be? I mean, I have a decent amount of knowledge in the location of ancient structures, I mean... It's not necessarily a building, I'm looking for a tool. A tool? Wait a minute. What type of tool is it? X. You're looking... Why? You're looking for that? Do you happen to know its current location? Well, I, that would be... I, 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 to pick. I know a bit about it, but... Not many people know much about that. I'm surprised you did at all. Well, you know... A to lot honest, of... I, I, have, I have my suspicions about you. Listen, a lot of the corpses from the Founders have a lot of heavy markings uh, that can only be made by an axe, so... When I recently discovered most of the bodies, I looked into it. I believe that that axe may have something to do with their deaths. So, believe me, I'm as interested as you in finding it. Figure out what happened. I mean, there is not much information about what... I, I know a lot about the Founders, yes, but there isn't much information of what happened after, or what caused them to die. Though I do have my working theories. my question, how much would you pay for that information? Because I may or may not have, you know, a little bit that you might need. Well, I are, I'm not really interested in learning it. I just want to know so that I can... I'm, well, I'm, I'm, I'm interested in it. I just... I'm not going to pay money for it. It can be found. Believe me. I don't need to pay anyone for it. Alright. You know what? I'm, I'm going to tell you a little bit of a story. Alright. The Founders... They, they weren't the best people. Well, no one's perfect. Yeah, but... They're... They... How do I explain this to a way that would make you understand my point of view? Wait a minute, you... I also have my suspicions about you. And what would that be? Well, there's sizable evidence that a few of the founders that were quote-unquote dead did not indeed die. Most of them, or some of them, 
went into hiding, uh, reincarnated, uh, perhaps somehow are even still among us today, under different names, different pretenses. I can, I can promise you they're gone. Mm, from what I, from what you with, know, perhaps, with the exception of, well, very select group of people. I can promise you that they're they're very much gone. I made sure of that. Well, there is some evidence that one founder did get to leave before they were killed. Mm. That, and I believe that, well, I still have trouble collecting the information on it, but you seem trustworthy enough to know what I know. I believe that uh, there were a string of murders leading up to the finale of, well, the Founders. None of their bodies sort of... All of the methods of their deaths are different. Everything is different. So I believe that what happened was it was just a straight-up string of deaths until, well, none of them were left. I, I only really have two candidates for who could have done it. And who are, who are those people? Well, there was one with an axe, and then there was one other one that I could not identify. Hmm. I'm surprised you haven't asked how I know as much as I know yet. Well, I don't want to ask anything. I don't want to go too deep, just in case I figure out something I'm not supposed to. How did you get that far that quickly. Did. Doesn't matter. But, I'm wondering if, wondering if revealing something to you would help at all with a little more of a bit of motivation, let's say, for completing this job in a timely manner. Well, depending on what it is, it might just either make me more motivated or more motivated to ask more questions. Let's I face it. Let's I'm face it, with... okay? You're looking for the axe that potentially murdered literally everyone. You're looking into spying on people who have connections with the founders. And do, don't you think that sounds... A little... odd? No, to be honest with you, I really don't. You don't see how looking for the murder weapon that potentially killed everyone, and then asking for where the remnants of those people are, is weird. No, I have my own motivations, as do you, I'm sure. I don't really have any motivations here. I just want to, you know, live a life of just relax, you know? I mean, there's not much reason for me to take any side here. I, I don't... I have a, I have a question. Yeah. I, I have a little bit. Yeah? So, I, I mentioned earlier I have a bit of a sneaking suspicion about you. Yeah? Does the saying, no hard feelings, ring any bells? Well, I mean, sounds relatively familiar, but then again, uh, things that sound familiar aren't always the case. Hmm. Got my eye on you. As do I. Listen, I'm not the one you should be worried about. Are you so sure about that? Yeah. I really am. I've I've never done anything wrong, so I don't see why there would be any reason for... You. I'm not so sure about that. You seem <laughs> to know a lot for someone who wasn't around during the time of the Founders. <laughs> Oh, not around. <laughs> well, sure. you know 
different things about different people that not even I could scrounge up with my information. And that information was what I could get from dissecting the tombs. I got up close and as personal as I could. But you still somehow need, seem to know more. Don't you think that's a little weird? It's really not if you have the context. But I'd see why it would be if you don't. Well, then why don't you divulge the context to me? Because, okay, I, I was around. <laughs> you That's were around. Okay. So you were one of them. Well, not how I currently look, but yeah. So... It was you, wasn't it? Hmm? Well, what was me? You're the one. Remember how I mentioned that I had a theory about one of them reincarnating or something? Yeah, yeah, you did mention that earlier. You're that person, aren't you? You're smart. Thank you. Well, good and bad thing on your part. I'll deal with it. I could sure. tell it is. So. And you're looking for the axe, which was, assuming that was your weapon, wasn't it? I made it. That doesn't necessarily mean that. You that doesn't necessarily it. mean I. But I did make it. Well, I do have. All right. All right. I'm gonna. All right. I'll I'll, I'll give you a little offer. I work with you, but that means you guarantee me my safety. I won't oppose you or anything, because now I know who you are. I don't have any reason to. And I'm not after any revenge. <laughs> oh, guarantee your safety. Yep. Yeah. I don't really want anything from you. And I don't think you want anything from me. Uh, I think that all I... you want sure? is the guarantee that I won't mess with your plans or whatever. And I have a bit of information that, well, might help you, if anything. What would I need to do for you to divulge that information? Just because, like I mentioned earlier, I have a little bit of a hunch. But You guarantee my safety. You let me live my life in peace. That's all I want. If my hunch is correct, though, I can't guarantee your safety. Then I can't guarantee that I'll disclose the location of a certain object. As if you'd know where that is. No one knows where that is. It's been gone for years. It's probably wherever I died. But... Say there was an observer. Someone who... Yes, died, but technically didn't. Something's telling me my hunch about you is correct. Well, the fact that I'm insinuating what I'm insinuating may give you a few ideas. But I'm trusting you because... Why? Okay, you know what? Last time I trusted you didn't go well. And why is that? Hmm? Wanna, wanna give a little reminder? Because you bonked me in the head. That's right. So it is. Yes. But I'm not interested in any revenge or any sort of aggression. Hey, what's that, bud? I know relatively where your axe is, so if you want that, then you'll put that away. Unless, of course, you don't want that information, or you don't want the information on the whereabouts of the survivors, or you don't want closure. You have no idea how lucky you are right now. Hmm. I think I do. Let me see how I invited you over for dinner. You bonked me, drowned, whatever. You know, that's that's in the past. I don't really hold any I don't I don't hold you accountable for that. 
And, well, technically, I don't... I'm not him, technically. I just share those memories. I'm aware of it. But that leaves a question. Now that I've divulged everything to you, what is your plan? Same one I've always had. So you... So wait a minute. Actually... Wait, wait, wait. Do you see that? There's someone here. They're invisible. I look like I care. Well, I mean, if they... Alright, I guess. I just don't want them... I don't want them knowing this as much as I don't want you knowing it. I don't have much of a care for you knowing it now, because there's no point. But... But now that you do yep. know it, I'm sure that you'd like to ask some questions or something. That is, if you're even interested. <laughs> some questions. You... Oh, God, it wasn't technically you, but oh, God. Oh, I'm not stupid. I know what that dinner was about. I was gonna ask you to help me, you know find who it was, or at the very least, ensure my safety, because I didn't want anything to do with it. What, you think I was with them? No, I, I stayed, I stayed underground for a reason, you know. I didn't agree with their views either. But yeah, here you are, trying to threaten me with an axe or whatever, because apparently I was just friends with them, even though that I did not agree with their views in the slightest. If you didn't agree with their views, <laughs> then why did things go down the way they did? Because you assumed I did. You would have stuck me down there. I didn't want to. I wasn't interested in a fight. I was just interested in my own life. I didn't really... Because I, I mean, let's be real. Was I as strong as you back then? Not close. Exactly. Not close. And I'd argue that you still aren't. Exactly. Right. But... Which would, which would make my job a lot easier. Uh, but it actually wouldn't. Remember, I have information on the survivors. I have information on the axe. I have information maybe on... a few other people who slipped through the cracks. Your work was impressive. It was genuinely impressive to see how well you cleaned up everything, but you do realize that there are, like, a few people left, right? From what I know, yeah, there are. So you blatantly lied to me earlier. <laughs> I've never been one to divulge information. I really, I've, I've never been <laughs> the type of person to be very truthful with you. Well, we're on the same playing field now, so you know everything about me now. We're on the same playing field. Are you, are you listening to yourself right now? Yes, I am, but again, do you have the information about the survivors or the whereabouts of your axe? Do you? I'd say that evens the odds for me a bit. You... you have a lot of impressive stuff on your side, but for all of that, you do not have much information about... What was her name who killed you? I remember it was... you, you do know. You remember, do you remember when we were standing right over there? Yeah, it was pretty nice. We were vibing. Did I have a bit of information about the person on the left? Yes. They're their descendant, aren't they? Mm-hmm. I have big plans with that one. The person who killed you survived, you know. They're still out there. I don't trust that. <laughs> I... How would they have died if you were dead? Neither one of us are in our same bodies, and that took some time for the both of us, because... The moment you killed me, you, you, oh. Yeah. Well, they're here. 
I just, I think they are here. You know, now that I, now that I think about it, what would be easier for you, that spying job or getting a little information on someone else for me? One specific person. Well, I need all the details of the job. I can't just go off of titles. Okay. So, I'm not always active in this body. There's someone else. Yes, I'm aware. My... How much information can you get me on him? Him? Well, I need information on him in order to gain his trust. I can't just... Oh, he's a complete wimp, doesn't know anything about what he's doing, and has been hiding from me for the past I don't even know how long. So I need to know where he is, what he's doing. Any of those details would be great. Oh, don't worry. My current vessel is also a wimp. Uh, I'm pretty sure they'll get along. Well, that I'm not surprised about. Well, I'm not quite surprised about you either. On uh, second thought... I'm surprised. Yeah, that's what I thought. I, I will tell you, I may not, you know, always be active, but I know where everything is. I know the general area that it is in currently. Yes. I just don't get there. If you take me to the general area, I could search it. I know that you can't go there, but I can't. I'll find a way to get there. Don't bother. So... Listen, if you just... Now... Okay. If we just work together for a bit, I can help... <laughs> Give me a good reason why I should work with you with the suspicions that I have. Well, what suspicions do you have about me? I can pretty much diffuse them. Like I mentioned before, I'm about 99% sure that you are working with the people who were possibly trying to kill me. Buddy, I just woke up the same time you woke up. Listen, I had some, let's say, interesting projects. Have you ever heard of a conduit? Yes, I have, because you... Oh, God. Yes. Okay. Listen, listen, us working together, I do not think would be in anyone's best interest. I think I just need you to get that information for me and we can be done. All right. And my safety? Like I said, there's no guarantee. Hmm. <sighs> You've put me in a bad spot because I know that if I deny this job, then it's over for me, isn't it? Well, yeah, because I'd have no reason that I need you to be here. Again, information about your acts, information about survivors. I can figure that out by myself. Hmm. I suppose you can. But... Alright. So what do I need, need to, to do? Get... Way. Christ, all he does is complain and walk around and talk about the bees, the flowers, whatever. What a wimp. Well, that's true, but at the very least, that gives me a bit of a window of opportunity to get into him. Just talk to the kid. Do your job. I will. I'll see if, you know, see if he wants to, you know, maybe even donate a bit to me. Huh? Hmm. Right, it's your stuff too. Yeah, that would, that would not go well, would it? Yeah. 